5 to the a minus 5 to the b equal to 600 a, b are integers. We want to find all possible values for a and b. First, well, we can consider a and b are at least 0. Okay. And then we say, okay, 5 to the a minus 5 to the b equal to 600. If you consider it's 5 squared times 4 times 6, 24. 24 is 5 squared minus 4. And we can write, we know that b is a smaller because it's positive 5a minus 5b. We can write it as 5a minus b minus 1. And uh, this form is unique. So we conclude this part equal to this part, this part equal to this part. So we conclude b equal to 2 and a minus b also equal to 2. So a minus 2 equal to 2, a equal to 4. Okay, it is our first answer. a is 4, b is 2. And we want to prove we don't have any other answer except this a4, b2. Second case, if one of them be negative, for example, we have lots of uh, one of them be negative, one of them positive. From here, we know that a should be greater than b because 5 to the a minus 5 to b is positive. So if a is, for example, at least 0, b negative, then we conclude 5 to the a because a is at least 0 is integer, and 5 to the b because b is less than 0 is not integer. So 5 to the a minus 5 to the b integer minus a non integer number is not integer. That's a contradiction because it is 600. Third case, if a negative and b negative, then 5 to the a is less than 1. So 5 to the a minus 5 to the b is also less than 1 because 5 to the b is a positive number. But we know this number is 600, which is again contradiction. So we proved our only answer here is a equal to 4, b equal to 2 as homework. Let me write the problem. Try to solve this 5 to the a minus 5 to the b equal to uh, 3000. Okay, this one. Try to solve this problem as homework and comment your answers. How many answers are there? A and B are integers and comment your answers right below this video. If you have questions, send a message to my WhatsApp number. And please don't forget to subscribe, turn on the bell, and like the video. Thanks. Bye.